being good. Okay, today I got something to share with all my students here. Okay, I hope you guys like it and learn something and do it at home. Okay, now the topic that I'm going to do is what we call them as a simultaneous equation. In DM, we will call them as a per samaan sarantak. Okay, now, sir, this topic will come out in my SPM or not? Yes. If they are asked in SPM, how many questions, sir? They are going to ask one question and the marks can go up to four marks. Are you okay? Guys, if you want to solve the simultaneous equation, we got mainly two methods. One, we will call them as an elimination. One, we call them as a substitution. Okay, today, sir, going to do about the elimination method. Okay, now, sir, let me write down the concept first. Then we go for the question. Okay. Now I want you to memorize on this. We got two. One we call them same. When you heard about the word same, we are going to do the what minus. Memorize this place class. When we talk about different, different, we are going to do what plus. Are you okay? Now what does it mean by same and different? Sir? Same means you will see something like same, positive and positive, or you will see negative and negative. Is it same? Yes. Is it same? Yes. Now, how about different? Different means we will talk about one will be plus, one will be minus, or one will be minus, one will be plus. When different, we are going to do what? Plus. When same, what are you going to do? Minus. Are you clear with that? Okay. Now, let me continue with the question. Now, memorize again class. Same, what are you going to do? Minus. Different, what are you going to do? Plus. Okay. Now, let me sir, write down the question. I hope you also copy down the question. So we will do together. Okay. 2x minus y equals to 9. My first equation. Second equation will be 4x plus 3y equals to 3. This is my second equation. Are you okay with this, guys? Okay. Now, my first step. Let me write down the steps also. Step number 1. Step number 1. You are going to choose unknown. Choose what? Unknown. Are you okay? Now, sir, step number one, I am going to choose my unknown. Unknown means what? Look at this. Huh? I got X. I got X. I got Y. I got Y. Are you okay? Now, if the choices is yours, you can choose your X or you can choose your what? Y. Okay. Now, before that, here got number two. Here got number four. Here got number three. Here never write anything new. It's considered there's a number one. Are you okay? Sir, I'm going to choose my unknown. I can choose my X or I can choose my Y. Why? Now my suggestion would be go and look into the smallest number. The smallest number here is what? One. So I'm going to choose my Y. Are you okay? Step number two. Once you choose your unknown, you're going to make the number same. Let me repeat again. Step number two, you're going to make the number same. Make the number same. Are you okay? What does it mean make the number same, sir? Okay. Now, you can see here is 1, here is 3. So, I'm going to make the number same. So, I'm going to times the entire equation by 3. Are you okay? Now, when you're going to times the entire equation by 3, it means 3 times 2x, 3 times negative 1, negative 3y, 3 times 9, you're going to get what? 27. Let me write down. 3 times 2x become what? 6x. Okay. 3 times negative 1 become negative 3y. Equals to 3 times 9 going to be what? 27. Are you okay with this, guys? Okay. Now, now we're going to go for the step number 3. Step number 3 means you're going to check whether same check whether same or different same or different so just now i got mentioned same means what are you going to do minus different means what are you going to do plus okay look at this up huh? my x and x is here the number is 4 and 6 my y is here 3 and 3 yes or no now you tell me positive and negative plus and minus is it same or different different when different what i'm going to do plus so i put a bracket here and put the what plus are you okay right after you put the plus you can cut this one and this one so remaining is what 4x plus 6x yes or no let me simple down the way 4x plus 6x is equal to 10x 10x equals to now 3 
times 23 plus 27 going to be 30. Are you clear guys? Let me recap a bit. Sir, first time we choose the unknown. We got X and Y. We got X and Y. We got X and Y. But we choose what? Y. Because the smallest number is what? 1. So we are timesing everything by 3 to make it design, design, design. Same. So 3 times 2X become what? 6X. 3 times 1 become 3. 3 times 9 become 27. After that, we already choose your Y. Yes or no? Look at this place. Plus and minus. Is it same or different? Different. Different means we are going to do what? Plus. Once you put the plus, we are going to cut that one. This is what we call them elimination method. Now, so balance answer. 4X plus 6X is equal to what? 10X. 3 plus 27 equal to what? 30. Now, I am going to find my X. Huh? If I want to find my X, X equals to 30 over 10. Therefore, my X answer is equals to what? 3. Are you okay? I am done. But, your question got X and Y. We already found out your X. Now, my job is to find out my what? Y. So, when you want to find your Y, you can choose any one of the equation. For example, I want to choose this also can. Or I want to choose this also can. Based on the cutting here. Can I not? Okay, for example, I'm going to choose the first one. So, I'm going to write down here. So, 4X plus 3Y equals to 3. Are you okay? Now, what is my X value? 3. So, I'm going to take the 3 and substitute inside here. If I substitute inside here, it's going to look like this. 4 bracket 3 plus 3Y equals to 3. Are you okay? So, 3 times 4 become what? 12. Plus with 3y equals to 3. Are you okay? Now, sir, my job is to find out my y. So, here never write down anything means consider what? Positive. Positive, I throw to that side become what? Negative. So, 3y equals to 3 minus 12. Are you okay? You can use your calculator. 3y, you will get it as a negative 9. Are you okay? Now, I am going to find my y, sir. If I want to find my y, Times 3, I throw there become what? Divide 3. So, y equals to negative 9 over 3. y equals to negative 3. So, this is my final answer. So, let me repeat again class. We got mainly 3 steps. Step number 1, choose your unknown. You can choose your x and you can choose your y. Right after choose your number uh, unknown, you are going to choose make it the number same. If you choose your y, you are going to make the y number same. If you choose your x, you're going to make the x number same. Now, after that, remember just now the first time I told you, the first lesson, same means we're going to do what? Minus. Different means what are you going to do? Plus. So, since this is a different, we're going to do what? Plus. If I say this is same, I'm going to do my what? Minus. Are you okay? Then you solve your x. After you got your x, then you're going to go for what? Y. Are you clear? Okay. So, I hope you learned something and I will attach the... All of the past year questions on the below, okay, there is a PDF file for all of you. Please try everything. I will discuss the answer and I will send the answers to all of you, okay. Thank you very much. God bless all of you.